Good morning guys, I hope you're all well. Today I'm gonna to be doing another vlog. Just a home day vlog, I'm staying in today. Rich and I went away for a couple of days, um, like Sunday to Tuesday. We booked a trip to Soho Farmhouse, like as soon as we found out that our South Africa trip would be canceled, which actually hasn't officially been canceled yet, but we're definitely not going and we hope to get our money back. But we booked something else just in the UK because we were like, we really just wanted Grey to like get in a swimming pool and just have a couple of days away. And we got so lucky with the weather. If you follow me on Instagram, you would have seen some photos and stories from there. It was just such a special like couple of days. We really, really enjoyed it. But I missed a work day on Monday because of it. So today I've got a lot of catching up to do. I've got to film a video. I've got loads of emails to reply to. Just got some like admin stuff to do. This video is also going to be sponsored by HelloFresh. You guys know I work with them a lot and I'll be showing you some of their new features and making lunch for Rich and I whilst Grey has her lunchtime nap. So I'll show you that later on in the video. You might have noticed my teeth are different. I wasn't really going to do like a full on YouTube video about it. I don't know. It feels like a little bit personal. It's like one of those things I kind of want to talk about but I also don't want to talk about too much. But what I am going to do is do like a full on stories q a update with all of the details i feel like that would be really helpful and like informative so at some point when they are finished i will do that on stories and i'll save it to my highlights so definitely like follow me on instagram and you can keep updated there these are just the temporary teeth so they're the same color and shape as the final ones will be but they're just temporary so this is all like one piece of acrylic um, I'm gonna have the individual like porcelain veneers put on soon so I promise I think my appointment's having to be delayed but um, I promise I will properly update you when they are finished um, I just want to show you like the proper finished ones not the temporary ones you know but you can kind of get an idea of how they look and I'm so happy and I'm so happy to be smiling again and not like constantly closing my mouth and feeling really self-conscious so before i film my video i think i'm filming for this sunday like an agony aunt q a type video i've never really done anything like that before and i feel like i don't know it'll either go down really well or really badly like i'm obviously not a trained professional in any way to answer anyone's problems but i get dms all the time with like people sharing their like life issues with me so I thought I'd do like an agony aunt kind of section so that's what I'm going to film I got loads of questions from you guys on Instagram but before I do that I wanted to check in on our podcast Facebook page if you guys aren't already involved um it's at home with Lily and Anna on Facebook I'll put the link in the description box I've never had a Facebook page before and I've never been part of one like this like I was part of like a baby's one when I just had grey but it's so cute. I love it so much. Like people share like, they share like all kinds of different things on here. TV recommendations. There's stuff on there like people sharing tips on like how to sell your property. The conversation, I love it so much. Like people talking about my pregnancy vlogs on there. And I try to reply to as many like threads and comments as I can and just get involved. I love looking at it. So if you guys are wanting like a nice place to have like a bit of a community, because obviously you guys DM us and you, we post and stuff on Instagram, but like on Facebook, it's a much more of like a two-way conversation. It's a real community vibe. Oh my God, I love this. Someone said, starting Monday, I want to start asking my students about their peak of the weekend. Thank you for inspiring me. Very excited to hear about my students' answers as they're usually quite creative and cheeky. So she's a teacher and someone said, I actually adapted the peak of the week, 100% yum, top of the box and others with my students as well. They're enjoying it so far, always eager to share their favorites from the past week thank you Lily and Anna someone said I'm a teacher and a sixth form tutor and I love this idea struggling to get my year 12 and 13 to talk to each other at the moment so I think I'll try this tomorrow oh my god I literally love that so much I love that Woo! okay I think the first thing I'm gonna do is film this video get this done before Grey has a nap so I can make noise basically because I'm at home today I'm just dressed super comfy this is a two-piece from me and M I really like the jumper because it's kind of cropped and it's got this kind of bat wing arm and then the joggers come up kind of high waisted so you don't show any tummy and it's just so comfortable but then also doesn't look like I'm in pajamas so yeah this is what I'm wearing and I think I'm just gonna film wearing this I need to film a video can I film okay okay I just filmed the agony aunt Q&A it was so fun I loved it if you haven't seen that it would have gone up last Sunday so I will link it here um, have a little watch. Can you see how bad my skin is? 
When I get spots around my chin, I'm pretty sure that's hormonal and that's just from coming off the pill and like I normally get it a week before my period, but I never get spots on my cheeks. I'm pretty sure this is from wearing a mask. I think I need to get better at washing my masks. Also just cause it gets like sweaty under there. I'm watching Caroline on this morning. She's actually doing a whole section on if you get spots from wearing a mask. I now want to order all of these products. So thank you, Caroline, for that. Okay, Grey has just gone down for her nap. Rich is doing a little bit of tidying up. We like to kind of reset to the downstairs area while she sleeps so we can then mess up again after her nap. I'm gonna make us lunch. I'm so hungry, I'm really excited. As I said, this video is sponsored by HelloFresh and today I'm making one of my favorite recipes. We get this one, whenever it pops up on the app, we always pick this one. Miso aubergine with jasmine rice roasted tender stem and sesame mayo drizzle. Mm, delish. Before I start cooking, I wanted to tell you guys about a little update that HelloFresh have made to their app that I think you will be really interested in. It's their custom recipe tag. So there will be three recipes every week that you can customize. And by that, I mean you can switch out ingredients. So if you're not a fan of coriander, hello sometimes most of the time you can switch that out for something else and they're all like approved by the chefs so you know it's not going to mess up the recipe you can add stuff in you can swap them out you can double up on protein so you can basically change and tailor the ingredients so they work for you which is perfect although there's like a huge range of recipes to pick from i know that some people are fussy eaters or they have certain things they don't like certain flavors so i think that's such a genius update it just means there's always something that you're gonna love as you guys know the recipes come with these cards that tell you you everything that you need all the kind of pre-portioned ingredients and step-by-step -step guide on how to make it so easy this one's gonna take 40 minutes so I'm gonna crack on I need to cut my aubergines there is a life I lead in this city Hurrying to cut my teeth I can take what I need to get by It doesn't make it easy The other piece of my heart moves slow Somewhere in the great unknown When I return from the afterglow Will you carry me like I am whole again? Wait, hold on me together, take me back where I belong I want it all I had a feeling but the feeling is all Guys, so exciting I bought a new Zester I think you guys recommended this to me It's like super sharp, works so much better than our normal grater So I can use this to zest the lime I've been using it for like a month now And I can confirm it is great <laughs> Half the sesame seeds are mixing with the miso paste and the other half are getting mixed with some mayonnaise. Okay, aubergines need shaking. Our oven is so hot. It's much hotter than any other oven. Let's turn this down a little bit. Tender stem broccolis are gonna go in the oven. Pairing with the light poles When I return from my spinning bowl I'm remembering the words you told me I recently got this H&M uh, linen runner for the table, which I quite like, and also this little cake stand. So we're going to sit here, have lunch together, catch up. Hold on, put me together, take me back where I belong. I want it all, I had a feeling, but the feeling is all gone. We're discussing possibly ordering Grey a little plastic slide for our garden. We haven't got room for like playgroundy stuff. I feel like a swing, they just kind of get a bit like moldy and she won't, she doesn't, she doesn't love a swing, she gets bored quite quickly on the swings. So we're thinking a little plastic slide, she loves slides and the small ones she can like climb up herself and not fall off. That's what we're talking about. <laughs> How exciting is our life? Mm. This is so yummy. So good. 
I'm obsessed with red onion. No, like, cook like Caramelized this. Mm. Me so mm. If you guys want 50% off your first HelloFresh box and 35% off your next three boxes, just use my code Hello Lily Pebbles. Hello Lily Pebbles. I think that's my favourite code so far. Um, yeah. Yum. It's 20 past two. At 2.30, I have got a brainstorm meeting with Anna, and I think a couple of our managers are gonna join as well. We've got a really exciting like podcast thing coming up. Um, it's actually for Christmas. So weird to be talking about Christmas, like where has this year gone? Um, we have got a really, really cool, I mean, I don't wanna like jinx it, but a cool collaboration coming up. We're both so excited about it. So we wanna like have a little brainstorm and come up with some cool ideas so we can make it really special. I'm gonna go see what Rich and Grey are doing downstairs because it sounds fun and I need to wrap my friend's birthday present. Where are you going? We're trying to we're trying to fix the grass because it's just not looking good. Look where Grey's standing, you can see that's where Rich did a workout and it's just dead. Apparently it's quite easy to fix grass though, we need yeah. to order some seeds. So what I've done. She doesn't even mind getting wet. Not in phase. Um, so I am prepping. Oh, you're getting me wet! I'm watered seeds, so I'll lay the seeds tomorrow, and it needs to be wet and damp before you do it, so I thought I'd get it started. Mm. Grey was just feeding me one of her snacks. Look how cute this is. Oh, my teeth feel funny. Can't wait to get the proper ones fitted. I bought this for my friend for her birthday. Her daughter is called Agnes, and I found this little um, Etsy seller called Agnes London. So this is from Etsy and it's a headband. Really cool, like, sorry, Daniela, I'm trying it on. But she wears cool things like this and I think she'll love that. So I'm gonna wrap that up for her birthday. This is where we keep like, oh, I can't wait to get these boxes changed. Worst boxes ever, these are from Ikea, but they are not what I wanted. I really wanna get proper like Perspex containers in here. I just, every time I try and measure it, I get overwhelmed and I can't figure out what I need. I've got some birthday cards in here, sellotape. Those are like acrylic paints. Oh, this really needs organizing. Okay, we've got sellotape. I think I'm gonna get the, color, the felt tips. I've got an idea. If I just use brown paper, I can decorate it. Have I got any birthday cards though? Damn, I do not have any birthday cards. That is very annoying. Okay, I'm just gonna use brown paper measure out what I need and then I'm going to decorate the paper. I can hear a baby running towards me. She's seen that I've got scissors and she wants them. I'm wrapping a birthday present. Let's cut it over here. These are very sharp so don't touch. Oh you've got wet hands, wonderful. Really really don't want you to get this wet, okay? I'm going to decorate this brown paper so it says happy birthday on it happy birthday love from lily rich and gray kiss 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 what do you think gray is this gonna be good or is it gonna be bad really i don't think i can give that to someone as a present Let's try again. Can Can, um, I mentioned them in my small brands video, have bought out a new bottle that's bigger and it's got this really cute illustration on it. Guys, I can't stop thinking about this armchair that I saw from Soho Home. It's ridiculous, but it was just so comfy and I love how like round it is. Look at this. <gasps> it's literally just come back into stock for like pre-order for December. Am I mad? Oh, I don't know. I'm going to go measure downstairs. Okay, look, we've moved. So that chair is not going to be there. I'm not sure this chair works here anymore because basically it used to be over here, but it was very squishy. This and then our sofa here. We've moved this chair here, but I also think this doesn't really work. This was inherited from our flat. We've had this for years. I think this actually 
doesn't really work, but maybe we keep this chair and get another chair one day. Put the Soho home chair here because it's it swivels. So you could like be facing the lounge if you want and then you could swivel it and you could face the play area. Okay, I measured and I don't think it would go well actually in the middle space because it's I think it's a little bit wide. I quite like having that middle space open and not having a chair there. We've been testing it out this week and I, I quite like it, but it would go really well by the window and it would soften the area a bit because I just think having the two blue sofas is like too much um, and this would just kind of like soften it a little bit. <laughs> I'm gonna help Rich with bath time and then I'm gonna go downstairs and uh, finish up my emails. Okay, Gray is asleep and I've just popped down to the kitchen because I thought I would bake a cake. There's a lot going on in our personal lives at the moment and I'm feeling a little bit overwhelmed and I just think sometimes baking a cake can clear your mind and actually it was really nice. I just wanted a really simple recipe. I actually wanted to make a honey cake. I didn't have the ingredients, which I was gutted about. Um, so I made a lemon drizzle, which is one of my faves. Here it is, ready to go. Oh, I just ate so much raw batter. Oh, I feel a bit sick now, actually. The cake's almost ready. I'm gonna let it cool and then pour over the yummy, sugary, lemony yumminess. I think I'm gonna end the vlog here because I just wanna sit and watch TV. But thank you guys so much for watching this vlog and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.